was all the lighter colors, which seem to come out at us. Lighter, lighter colors will always do that. The darker colors seem to recede in the background. And this represents some nighttime of chaos, of unknowing, of confusion. Uh, uh, so then, if, if this is a message, if this is an advertising billboard, what would be written on that to explain what you have inducted and deducted so far? You have explained it very well, inductive thinking. And deductive thinking, you have said, uh, you've to come to some conclusions. You have, to, you, have to, you have set certain parameters that this is daytime, this is nighttime. What is the overall message then? And then we had the green light, red light, which is very telling. So basically, this is a, pain, a, a painting by a very famous uh, uh, German uh, painter who, who uh, migrated to the United States eventually, Hans Hoffmann. And he painted this just before he died. And the name of this painting is Toward Crepuscule, which is a very big Latin word which means twilight. OK? Towards twilight. So this is towards the twilight of his life. He, is, uh, he dies very shortly after he's done this. I believe he painted this at 83, and he died at 85. And so this could be the youth of his life, the time of creativity and, and um, prolific ideas and thoughts and uh, philosophies. And, and, and somehow he's integrating all of that because there's a nice flow to it. And then this is the nighttime of his life, where he knows that his body is failing him. Perhaps his mind is failing him. And there's a lot of darkness. It is interesting when I do this with, uh, with uh, middle schoolers and high schoolers, somehow they always point this part out. A dark? Uh -huh. That's good. That's good. Yes? Uh, he knew that he had a condition that would kill him. Yeah. Um, Th that's good. So this over here, it could be a dog. So it's, it's something much more, some, something that is personal maybe, like something you can attach yourself to. A lot of kids say that these could be stars in the sky. Someone did say that this is the ocean. This could be the nighttime sky. So even in our darkness, we have these flashes of inspiration and flashes of hope and possibility and all of that. 